All right, folks, working with buyers in today's market. Look, if you're working with a buyer and you have and you can't find them the house they want, but you know a neighborhood or two that they would definitely live in, make sure you get a buyer broker agreement signed. You should have them signed by and every time you work with them anyway, and get out there and knock those neighborhoods. Okay? I mean, what better reason do you have? What would give you more confidence that I already have somebody that wants to live in this neighborhood? You know, how about you folks? Have you ever thought about making a move? And if you did, where would you go? You know, you might get a, you might double end that deal and sell them something else too. I mean, people are still looking to downsize and there's a lot of people on the fringe right now because of the interest rates and so forth, but they're starting to get a little bit better and the report is they're probably going to get even better and, you know, but regardless, we still have a tight inventory market. You know, you should definitely be out there knocking neighborhoods of the, of, of the, you know, the, the people that want to buy from you that you can't find anything. Create your own inventory, also for sale by owners. Go to Zillow, the Make Me Moves. I mean, there's so many different ways. Don't MLS is only one place. There are several other places. By the way, if you get in the habit of doing this, you know, like f visiting Fizbo's, you know, um, like a preview. That's the way I used to start with them. Right when they came on the market, go out and preview them. You know, hey, this is Rick, Berkshire Hathaway. I see you on the market for sale by owner. Good for you. I'm just calling to see if you're cooperating with real estate agents. Great. Love to come by and check out the property. If they say no, you wait a week and try them again. If they say no, then you wait a week and try them again. Eventually, they say yes. Now, the ones that want to sell, obviously, the ones that don't want to sell, you don't want them anyway. You know, when I used to run the Mike Ferry Prospecting School, that was the first question I would ask people. Who's looking for people who aren't moving? Right? You're not looking for people who aren't moving. You're looking for people who are moving. They act differently when you talk to them. You can tell. And then you'll develop prospecting feel. But don't give up when you can't find inventory. Go to the neighborhoods. Go to Zillow. Go to, you get for sale by owners. Hell, join Red X and you can keep up with it for sale by owners or Land Voice or Mojo. Or uh, you can say that way you can keep up with them as well. It'll give you all the information and their phone numbers. Okay?